South Koreans will most likely be able to trade crypto without having to pay tax on their earnings for at least another year after politicians signed off on an amendment to a much maligned and controversial tax plan, and a major blow to the government, was bitterly opposed talk of Adil A. Today, the National Assembly Planning and Finance Committee decided on creating a partial amendment to the Income Tax Act at a plenary session, with major media outlets reporting that this has virtually confirmed the delay, and that the move to 2023 is now de facto done. Per Mayo QG, as. However, all the media sources agreed that there was now a clear consensus in the House on the need for a delay, meaning only a minor miracle will derail the amendment when lawmakers vote on Thursday. The media outlets concurred that the vote would be little more than a formality. As reported, the President Moon Jae-in government is in its last days, with a general election looming in early March next year. The government had already created a draft bill proposing the introduction of a flat fee 20% levy on annual trading profits over 2 US dollars, 100 which the National Assembly initially signed off on, with a view to launching the tax on January 1, 2021. However, the tax has proven to be deeply unpopular among younger South Koreans, 